Guys, so we're in the valleys right now, walking to the Buca de Beppo. It's right in front of us. We're staying at the Paris, and Bali's is connected to Paris. Basically like Paris, so it's very convenient to get a breakfast right out of our hotel room after we just woken up. And then we can go sleep after too. Yeah. So this is the Buka breakfast. It looks like for the $12.99 all-you-can-eat all breakfast buffet, it has scrambled eggs, bacon, sausage, potatoes, and mini danishes. So you, so you can get as much as you like from that. If you want to add to your meal, you can add a stack of pancakes for $2.99. And then coffee and juice is $5.99. That's kind of... They have other stuff too, like you can get two egg breakfast, three egg breakfast, they have yogurts, but it's all additional, so it's not yeah. included in the twelve ninety nine. Yeah, you gotta get the all you can eat breakfast or for the bang for your buck. Yes. We have a lot of Buca de Beppo. Lea actually introduced me to Buca de Beppo for dinner for we pasta and Italian at, food. We went to the one at Universal Universal City Walk. Mm -hmm. If you guys are familiar, there's a really nice one there, um, in the middle of the city walk, so it's it's a fun place to go with like family and have celebrations. I've never had, I didn't know they had breakfast here, so let's try it out. Let's do it. We're gonna get the breakfast buffet. What do you want? You're gonna get that too? Yeah. <laughs> nice. I'll probably add pancakes to it, honestly, too. So, even the one in California, I really like the Buca de Beppo vibes. There's really nice ambience, like a nice Italian Thank you. vibes in here. Usually, on a regular day, there's a breakfast bar where you just go grab the food, but Unfortunately, well, not unfortunately, I mean, I guess there's always good in it because we got to be lazy and just sit here, but they bring the breakfast to us and we don't have to get up at all and they bring the eggs, bacon, sausage, and fruits, and what is it called? Danish pastry? Uh, sorted Danishes, mini Sorted Danishes, Danishes yeah. It's kind of nice, they just bring you out everything. Mm -hmm. And it's $12.99, so that's a pretty fair price for Vegas. And yeah, it's basically all you can eat breakfast, so if you guys are big breakfast eaters, it's a pretty good place to get some all-you-can-eat breakfast so there's not too many things on the breakfast menu so we're gonna eat everything on the breakfast menu so how are the fruits what's in the fruits I see watermelon is that watermelon mm -hmm. yeah it's just watermelon honeydew melon pineapple and regular melon nice is it good crunchy mm -hmm. yeah they're all fresh fresh yeah. fruit they're, they're good I like the fruits crunchy so what is the first thing on our all-you-can-eat breakfast menu <laughs> it's simple cheese danishes uh, Dan got a cherry one Mm -hmm. They have cheese, cherry, and apple. Mm How's -hmm. that? Okay. Let's take a bite of the cheese. This is like a little toaster stool. You see this? Mm -hmm. What's a Pillsbury Dose Boy? Mm -hmm. mm. There's not just cherry in there. It's cheese and cherry. Mm -hmm. It's very soft. How about yours? Mm -hmm. It's just cheese, right? I'm just cheese, yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. I like this cherry and cheese one. It's like a mix. How's it look? <laughs> it looks loaded. Nice. So you just brought us the standard breakfast right here. Got the eggs, bacon, potatoes, sausage. And guys, we could order this as many times as we want because it's all you could eat. But yeah guys, $12.99 for however many times you want to order this. But we basically got everything on the menu, right? We got the danishes. Yes. Got the bacon. A lot of potatoes, protein. Protein. sausage, and eggs. These eggs look really fluffy. I like my eggs super fluffy and scrambled. And they're fresh because they're not doing a buffet style anymore, so they just use order it fresh from the kitchen, and it comes straight from the kitchen to your dish. We are going to try our breakfast. Lay a salted and peppered for eggs, but I would like to try my eggs without the salt and pepper first. Mm. Nice and fluffy, a lot of yolk on there for that cholesterol. What do you think? I think it's a pretty decent sized breakfast mm -hmm. for all you can eat. You're gonna get every you're gonna get full of everything that you want. Mm -hmm. And the bacon doesn't look too fatty, it's nice and crispy. Take a bite of that. Mmm. Indeed. Very crispy. But not too burnt. And you guys know me. I got the ketchup right here. I always like to put ketchup on my on my eggs, so. Let's try the ketchup eggs. Personally, I don't like ketchup on my eggs. Mm. It's the only way you gotta eat your eggs. It makes it nice and sweet and tangy. Try the bacon, try the eggs. Try the sausage, the salchitas. 
So on the first plate they brought is like three sausages and like five bacon strips. That's a lot of breakfast. I know. You gotta add extra for the pancakes, but personally I don't mind savory breakfasts. I love savory breakfasts. Cheers. It's a regular big sausage. It's more on the saltier side. It's not like a sweet applewood bacon. It's more of a salty ish bacon, which is pretty good to me. Uh -huh. This is all pretty decent. Mm -hmm. That's all you could ask for for you know a breakfast, and it's all you could eat. Twelve ninety nine, which is pretty fair price. You get as much of these items as you can. So if you're a heavy eater, man, you guys are just starving in the morning. You guys need some big breakfast. Protein. Protein. Day Beppo has got you in the valleys. So last thing is the potatoes. Usually my breakfast potatoes are choice hash browns, but these will make do. They're not soggy, but they're not super crispy. Just big wedges. Definitely gotta dip these in some ketchup. Just like basic potato wedges. Mm -hmm. Solid. Solid, yes. <laughs> so we're gonna finish the rest of these breakfasts and I'm gonna come back and update you on how many plates we have. Comment down below how many plates you guys think that we're gonna eat. Yeah, one plate is good for later. I think I'm gonna get at least two servings, but don't want to overstuff myself because we got a lot of other places to go today. Leia got a white toast. Some butter and jelly. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Buttered. Mm. I'm a good toast. Love my toast with jelly. This is a must. Leia made me a nice jelly and butter toast. And she took off the crust for me. Uncrustables, smuckers. Actually, I only got a half serving for my second plate. Leia is almost finished with her first plate. But yeah, guys, these plates are underrated. They're pretty big, and it's just like typical breakfast. So I'm not gonna load up too much. So sorry to disappoint you guys. Alright guys, so we are back from Buca de Beppo's All You Can Eat Breakfast. Overall, in a nutshell, it was pretty decent breakfast if you guys like basic breakfast. And that's usually what I get at breakfast spots anyways. Eggs, bacon, sausage, that's all you need. So. Potatoes, danishes. Mm -hmm, for your heavy eater. Hey, eaters out there, fruits. And also, they gave us a free, what did they give us? Keychain. <laughs> Normally they charge you, they did try to sell us some photos. But um, they said today you can walk away with the free photo, so yeah, we got that. Thank you. So, if you guys liked the video, like it, comment down below where you should go next, and subscribe for more food vlogs. And do this.